Hey there, folks. Welcome back to X-Rated Talk Productions. Well, today, probably tomorrow or Saturday if you watch this video, um, the Power Rangers trailer came out, and we finally got a real look at the trailer. I can finally, I finally feel like I can give a distinct feeling on how I am looking at this movie at this point. All right, now, I've had highs and lows. I've hated the costumes. I've warmed up to the costumes. I've hated the way it looks so dark, but I've warmed up to it. I saw the teaser trailer and loved it, and then I saw the Goldar toy, and I hated it. The marketing campaign in this thing is weird, but it also seems to be working. And now this trailer comes out, and despite some possibly not so fun... How do I say this? Uh, cliche kind of music choice, you know that uh, that power song you hear in like uh, like the Fantastic Four movie that came out a, like a year or two ago. Or was it last year? And just lots of the, that song was weird, but it it was like it was like Power Rangers kind of cheesy, where it went with it because it was so cheesy. But that's always been like the Power Rangers way. Um. I don't know, I got, I got a feeling a lot of people aren't even going to care. But, I mean, what did we see here? We got fucking everything that everyone has been asking for since the announcement of Power Rangers. We got fucking the suits in action. And I'm liking the way they look in action. We're getting more humor, which I already saw a little bit of that in the first trailer, but whatever. We've seen fucking, we saw what Zordon looks like in... Who he, who he is, who, it's, it's, it's Brian Cranston, who did a whole bunch of Power Rangers voices back in the day. Which makes sense, because it does feel like they're acknowledging the legacy of Power Rangers. And, um, we saw Putties, and Rita in action, and Zords, and Alpha moving and talking. And, it, and it's all pretty good. You know, I, 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 I dig it. Goldar still looks like shit, but... I got a feeling that that's because Rita's abilities are rooted in the elements, which explains how the power coins sort of don't look like real coins, but then part of the, the earth, why um, the putties are looking like they're going to be all rock, and why Goldar is just a big goopy pile of fucking gold, because her powers, her because Rita's powers are based in the elements, particularly stones. Uh... Right, right, right. Um, the Zords are looking good. It seems like the Power Rangers is going to have a lot of uh, other masks kind of open when they talk, which we really didn't uh, see before. Uh, the Zord is looking badass. Um, I love this trailer. I, 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 I posted up on Facebook just a couple of weeks ago a picture of the fucking Goldar toy. And I was like, you know, you did it. You finally killed my enthusiasm for this movie. And then this fucking trailer comes out and says, Hey, you haven't seen nothing yet. Um, yeah, so if you haven't seen it yet, please go and see it. I got the chills a little bit. My hope is back up again. I I feel like this is going to be... I'm, not, I'm Nobody's going to win here. I'm either going to fucking hate this thing or I'm going to fucking love this thing. And each one of those is like battling. You know, more than any movie um, I've had in a while. You know, it's like, the past couple of movies I've seen recently, it was like Rogue One, it was like, oh yeah, I'm, it's going to be good. Uh, I, it's Star Wars. It's not going to fail. Uh, you know, Fantastic Beasts, I thought it was going to be pretty good, and it was. And, um, you know, like once in a while you can look at something and go, man, that is going to fucking suck. Or, man, that's going to be fucking awesome. But this, it's like, it's two opposing forces. Ugh. <laughs> oh. All right, well, thanks so much for watching. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.